The oldest and most prestigious tennis tournament in the world, the Wimbledon Championship, was live at the All England Lawn Tennis and Croquet Club in Wimbledon, London. And as the stars and tennis lovers gathered together to witness who was ultimately going to win the tournament, we still kind of expected our esteemed guests and favorite celebrities to show up in their fashions. Now, while some served us looks to remember, others were just a bit forgettable. So here are the top 10 best and worst dressed at the Wimbledon Tennis Championship 2024. Take a look. <laughs> First up on our best dress list and starting out strong, we have the beautiful Princess of Wales, Princess Kate. And for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this purple midi flare dress and I think she really looked beautiful in this look for sure. Now straight right into it, I just really love this purple look on her and just everything that it just truly represented. I mean, being that she just revealed her cancer diagnosis to the world 4 months ago, just showing up in this purple look which was also alluding to like the cancer awareness logo, this look just presented a much deeper meaning aside from just being like a pretty look and i can really appreciate that now this dress in itself fits nice it's pretty it's comfortable and it was very much on theme with the wimbledon brand in general i also really love the ruching details that we see at the top part of this look i think that in itself was a nice little detail and it kind of just added like visual interest to this look for sure i also really love this pleated detail that we see at the bottom of the dress i think that in itself just looked really beautiful in motion and i loved it overall even though this dress in itself was simple and modest it still very much had that impact at the function so yeah this look by princess kate is gonna be a hot for me up next on our list we have the stunningly gorgeous jordan dawn and for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this off-white halter neck long dress by Balmain and you cannot tell me that she did not eat up this look for sure because she absolutely did just that. Now we're definitely going to see like a lot of like simple pieces on this list and honestly that's just because the overall vibe of the event was just comfort and style and I think this look in itself was really a fine blend of those two components. Now I just really love the way this dress fits on her it looks really beautiful it looks really clean and i absolutely was just obsessed with it i also just love this sort of like off-white color on her i think it just really played into that tennis court theme of the event and i think it suits her really well i also kind of really love this sort of like grapefruit motif that we see on the dress that in itself just created some form of like dimension and really just elevated this look for me now for styling she has paired this look with a pair of white sandal heels and jewelry from bulgari and i mean she definitely just ate up this look for sure i love her hair i think that in itself just really finished off this look beautifully for her so yeah this look by jordan has to be a hot for me up next on our list we have the amazing indian actress sonam kapoor and for wimbledon 2024 she had on this yellow blue and black striped two-piece by bottega veneta and she was styled by the incredible ria kapoor and this is how you show up and show out for an event and i think she definitely just turned heads in this look for sure now the first thing that just really catches my attention when i look at this look is just the construction of the overall look now i love how this crop shirt just nips in at the waist area making sure that we don't lose her shape in this look i also really love this umbrella like detailing that we see on the maxi skirt i think that in itself just really added an extra layer of detailing to this look and i just think that it just works in making this look better for me now the consistency of the stripy details just felt really correct to me and even though this look in itself was easy breezy it was still very heavy on the fashion now for styling she has opted for this black half patent leather shoes a black clutch bag and a pair of sunglasses with golden jewelries and i just think that this look was a 10 out of 10 look for me so yeah this look by sonam has to be a hot for me up next on our list we have the super handsome Unkuti Gatua and for Wimbledon 2024 he had on this navy blue pinstripe three-piece suit by Ralph Lauren and he was styled by the incredible Felicity K and he definitely did his big one with this look for sure and I think he just looked 
dapper in this look i mean this three-piece suit was executed to perfection the color looks great on him it fits right and i just really love how he's just leaning into this more classic grown man type aesthetic i think he looks sleek and i just love that for him i also just really love the styling of this look with that inner light blue striped shirt with the white collar the long tie and the shoes and i mean it all just works for me Uncle really said he was going to show up and make a statement and that he definitely did with this look. So yeah, this look by Uncle has to be a heart for me. Finally, on our best dress list, we have the beautiful model Kika Gomez. And for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this all-white two-piece and a navy blue sweater right around the neck by Ralph Lauren. And I think this was definitely one of the looks that just made sense to me in terms of like fashion and comfort. Now, I just really love how clean this look is. I mean, white always just gives that angelic type look and feel. And I think that in itself was just coming through in this look look i also really love the jacket and how it just nips in at the waist area creating a better fit of the overall look and i love that i also really love those wide leg pants i think they just really complemented her proportions and i love that i love the styling of this look with that navy blue sweater tied around her shoulders i think that in itself just really brought together and completed this look in such a beautiful manner and i can appreciate that overall she looks clean she looks put together and you can tell that this look was intentional about serving us fashion so yeah this look by kika it has to be a heart for me first up on our worst dress list we have the beautiful anya taylor joy and for wimbledon 2024 she had on this nude toned halter neck top and a black mini skirt and this was just not my favorite look out of the bunch for sure i mean anya is such a fashion girly and we've seen that time and time again be it on like red carpet or for like movie press tours she has definitely been one to deliver the looks however this look in itself just felt a bit pedestrian to me and i know that wimbledon is all about the comfort but let's not forget the style element to that too i don't know i just did not like this nude top material that in itself just felt very fast fashion to me very sheen very pretty little thing and i also just did not love the skirt and just the way it just made her waist look really bulky i mean this look was supposed to be like a sexy type look but the proportions at the waist area was just a bit off to me this just felt like a look that would be appropriate for like you know casual brunching with the girls but not for the appearance at Wimbledon. So yeah, this look by Anya is going to be a chop for me. Up next on our list, we have the Ebony Beauty Judy Smith. And for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this green patterned bralette top, purple patterned pants, and a white and purple bomber jacket by Ralph Lauren. And this was just a lot for me now this look in itself just felt super chaotic to me with all the prints and the patterns especially because there was just no cohesion in the pairing of the looks now the top in itself was a different color with patterns the pants on the other hand was another colors with like patterns and the jacket in itself had those floral detailings with colors and then the head wrap everything was just screaming for attention and not in a good way because this just felt like pure chaos to me now the shoes on the other hand just made no sense with the overall look and that head wrap that in itself was giving me very grandma vibes i don't know but this look just did not do it for me so it has to be a chop for me up next on our list we have the stunning india Armatefio. and for wimbledon 2024 she had on this red strapless peplum dress and was i really leaving for this look or loving it altogether i really don't think so now no doubt that this color looks really great on her however she really just starts to lose me on this look because of just the construction of the dress i mean i just did not understand that corset moment going into that peplum detail and just that elastic portion of the look i also really just did not like the fabric that was used in the construction of this look it just felt very crinkly and rumpled all the time and that in itself is just always going to take away from a look i mean she is a star but this look was just giving me very personal assistance running around and not just the main character the raffia bag on the other hand just made no sense to where she was going to so i just did not understand that either so yeah this look by india has to be a chop for me 
Up next on our list, we have the gorgeous Catherine Newting. And for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this white and navy blue striped shirt dressed by Ralph Lauren. And she maybe might have taken the comfort aspect of this event a little too literal for me. Now, yes, I know that this is a game and we all just want to be comfortable. But there was just like better ways to have got about comfort without really sacrificing the style aspect of it. Now, this look in itself just felt very basic to me. It felt very regular schmegula. And quite frankly, it just looks like she's here to apply for the cleaning role. Because this look in itself was just atrocious to me. So, I'm just a bit confused by it. So yeah, this look has to be a chop for me. Finally, on our worst dress list, we have the beautiful Sheila Atem. And for Wimbledon 2024, she had on this black blazer, a cream camisole and blue denim pants. And yeah, this look was just so hideous and diabolical to me. I mean, we know she's an icon, but why does she look like an underpaid elementary school teacher right here? I know you see that too. I mean, this look in itself just did not hit the fashion mark for me. And I just really kind of expected better from her because she indeed has an amazing looking body. This look right here was kind of pedestrian to me, so it has to be a chop for me. Alright guys, we have come to the ending of today's video. In today's video, I share with you guys my top 10 best and worst dress at the Wimbledon Tournament 2024. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up. It helps me a lot. And yeah, I'll definitely catch you guys in the next one. But for now, it is bye for now. Au revoir.